Good morning, everybody. Um, as you can see, I picked up a used Bellicon. Um, it is the 44 inch frame. It does have a um, stability bar that I can put in here and it's actually in my truck. I'm not gonna attach it because I'm not gonna use it. I just really want to show everybody like truly the difference between the seller size bounce and the Bellicon bounce and why seller sizer is better. So, um, anyway, I'll get around this. So, when I first stepped onto it, I'm like, all right, um, I had to catch my balance. It's not ready to receive me, if you will. It's a higher step up, which isn't a big deal for me, but it's not a preferred option. And for most people, it will cause you to shift off balance. But if I were to try to do the health bounce, I'm not even staying a whole lot lower than that. I'm not gonna get as many bounces per minute as the seller size or even can like, can it, the seller size or destroys this. So, but if I were to, let's just say, um, oh, Jamba Lock. Okay. This is fine. I'm not feeling nearly the resistance that my seller sizer offers. So, um, what else can I show you that you, I don't know if you can see, there's no coning, but if I get any leverage, like if I were to jump on this um, for any cardio, okay, great. I'm suspended longer in the air. And this has more of, the rebounder feel that a kid's trampoline would have. But I feel like I'm suspended for so long, I can't get even like an off balance, a ski patrol if I wanted to, the way that I can on my solar sizer. So, and I'll do some of the same things on my solar sizer just so you can see. But I mean, this is fun, but for twice the price, <laughs> I have a solar sizer makes zero cents so oh and running i'm like it's it feels so choppy so there's just not enough resistance i'd have to get really strong bands from them which are 72 dollars to replace them just to be able to run the way that i can on solar sizer anyway hope that helps